weather-wise, what's going on around this country makes you appreciate this calm lunch hour even more. Tim, take it away. Yeah, you're absolutely right, Marty. And uh, unfortunately, we're getting impacted by at least two of the systems. The wildfires out west bringing us some haze, and the storms down to the south is going to bring us some clouds uh, and maybe even a shower or two south of our area going into Friday. We'll talk about all of that right now. Looking at Dave and Phyllis Mallon, checking in with 70 degrees in Centerville. Other weather watchers this afternoon Justin Wilkie and Glen Burnie, 71 degrees. Twyla Floor, 67 up in Waynesboro. Robert Hislop in Parole, 70. And Ron Boblet, 67 degrees in his neighborhood down in Ellicott City. 70 is the temperature at BWI Thurgood Marshall. And we'll get a little help of, for the temperatures going up with this southwest wind at just around 8 miles per hour. Barometer is still pretty high, 30.22 as high pressure stays in control. 73 degrees right now in Salisbury and in Ocean City. Not a bad day to be down on the beach. We have 67 in Elkton. 60s across the top portion of the state until you get out to uh, Cumberland and it's 52 degrees. So we do have some cooler air. Uh, we're tapping into that at, as we move into the afternoon. The winds are variable. We have a bit of a southerly flow from, say, central Maryland on out to the west. We have a bit of a southeast wind down around Ocean City. That's going to help contribute to the cloud cover. So a light breeze out there and still with that hazy sunshine. So let's talk to you about uh, Sally. Sally, now the eye of Sally has now moved on shore. It's moving just around five miles per hour to the north now, about 15 miles to the north of. Uh, uh, Mobile and it made landfall this morning about 4 45 this morning as a category two hurricane. It is now a category one storm. And as I mentioned, the five mile per hour movement is still very, very slow. So the rain and the flash flood potential is going to be with us uh, and down in that region for the next 12 hours or so until the system that we're talking about picking this up and kind of lifting it starts to bring it a little closer to us. The rain, we've been talking about some areas with rain as high as about, uh, rain amounts as high as about two feet or so, but the system is going to start to be downgraded now. Depression by uh, tomorrow afternoon and the low moving down toward uh, North Carolina, just close enough to us that we'll get some gloomy conditions, maybe some cloud cover and maybe a shower south and east down around the coast. But the high pressure will stay in control. The quiet and comfortable conditions stay with us through tomorrow, and Sally will not really impact us too much. So 75 degrees today, hazy sunshine, otherwise pleasant. Tonight's overnight low down around 60 degrees. We will have your complete seven-day forecast with Marty coming up in just a few moments. We've talked about cool air on the way, but CNs believe, and look at those overnight lows, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. B-R-R-R-R, back to you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Marty. That sums it up.